We're also following breaking news this morning as well. A woman is shot and killed during a robbery attempt just right outside of her apartment in North Philadelphia. Police say the victim fought back and may have critically injured a teenage suspect. Wakisha Bailey has more. Well, police tell us they not only have surveillance video, but they also have recovered two guns from the scene. And now they are investigating if a 15-year-old boy is connected with the shooting and is he a suspect. Now, this is seen from early this morning, just around 2 o'clock, when police responded to a shooting at the 5100 block of North 12th Street. When they arrived, they found a 26-year-old woman laying outside her apartment with multiple gunshot wounds to her chest. Now, witnesses tell police a woman and a friend were entering the apartment complex when they were approached by two individuals wearing masks. There was then an exchange of gunfire between the woman and the suspects and police say at least five shots were fired, ultimately leaving the 26-year-old dead. Now we're told the suspects left the scene in a white car. Minutes later, a white car drops off a 15-year-old boy at Einstein Hospital. Now police are looking through surveillance video to see if the cars match. 15-year-old was shot in the hand, the shoulder, and the chest. Now, this 15 year old is, is currently being worked on at Einstein Hospital. He's in critical condition. The detectives are at Einstein Hospital, and as soon as this 15 year old is stabilized, or if he's stabilized, detectives will be able to talk to him. But right now, he is in critical condition because he's shot in the chest, also the shoulder, and the hand. But he is being worked on still by doctors at Einstein Hospital. But homicide detectives are also on one location at Einstein Hospital. Police tell us speaking with that 15 year old boy, along with reviewing surveillance video, is going to be key in this investigation. Lakeisha Bailey, CBS News, Philadelphia.